This Week in Michigan Football History with Professor Greg Dooley. Hello to the Maize and Blue faithful out there. In a season that falls on the 25th anniversary of our 1997 national title, today we honor the man who led that team. So let it be written that on this day in Michigan football history, the hallowed Big House Tunnel will forever be dedicated to Coach Lloyd Carr. When designing Michigan Stadium, Fielding H. Yost was inspired by drawings of the Roman Coliseum, and he intentionally had the tunnel take the teams directly to the center of the stadium, like gladiators, for all the spectators to see. This special honor will ensure that each national championship winning coach has a permanent place on the athletic campus. Yost with the Ice Arena, Fritz with the Chrysler Center, Oosterbahn with the Fieldhouse, Kipke with the street outside the stadium, and now Carr with the iconic stadium tunnel. But that's not the end of the history lesson, because it was on this day, exactly 90 years ago in Columbus, that the Michigan Marching Band unveiled a new formation to the fans at the Horseshoe when they spelled out O-H-I-O in cursive letters across the gridiron. Today, the Buckeye fans call it their beloved script Ohio and try desperately to deny that it was invented by the band belonging to that team up north. Hey, Bucknuts, you're welcome. With our friends from Happy Valley in town, we have another glorious memory to share. This one from 2005 that is affectionately known in these parts as simply Touchdown Manningham. After Penn State went up 25-21 to on what looked to be a game-sealing TD with under a minute to go, they unwisely kicked the ball to the dangerous Steve Preston, who took it 40 yards to the Michigan 46. Chad Henney connected on a series of quick strikes to move the ball down the field into enemy territory. Lloyd Carr successfully negotiated with the refs to add a couple of critical seconds on the clock, but the Penn State defense stiffened. It came down to a final play with just a single tick left on the clock from the 10. From the coast of Lake Michigan to the coast of Lake Erie, it sounded like this. Henny dropping the throw, looking right, looking right, fires toward the end zone, touchdown! Mario Manningham caught it on the coast! And Michigan will win! 27 to 25 on the last play of the game! Manningham's iconic touchdown sealed Michigan's seventh straight win in the series. So say it along with me. We own Penn State. Go Blue! Beat the Nittany Lions. Congrats to LC. And for more, check out mvictors.com and wtka.com for the Key Bank Countdown to kick off. This is Professor Greg Dooley.